Human bonds are a mixture of blessing and a curse. Blessing, because it is really tremendously pleasurable and tremendously satisfying to have another partner uh, on whom you can rely and do something for him or for her. It's uh, something, uh, it's some uh, kind of experience which is unavailable to the Facebook friendship. So it's a blessing. And I think that very many young people don't even, are, they are not even aware what they lost because they never experienced this sort of situation. Um, on the other hand, it is a curse because once you enter the bond, you expect to stay there forever. You swear, you take an oath, you take an oath, till death do us part, right? Forever. But what does it mean? It does mean that uh, you mortgage your future. Perhaps uh, tomorrow or the next, or next month or next year, uh, there will be new opportunities now unheard of, you, you can't predict them, and you won't be able to pick them, these new opportunities, because you will be already tied by your old commitments, old obligations. So it's in a very ambivalent situation, and hence the curious phenomenon of this person, solitary person in a crowd of solitaries, right? We are all in solitude and in a crowd at the same time. That there are two essential values which are absolutely indispensable for a satisfactory, satisfying, rewarding, relatively happy life. One is security, the other is freedom. You can't be happy, you can't have a decent dignified human life in the absence of one of them, right? Uh, security without freedom is slavery. Freedom without security is complete chaos, inability to do anything, plan anything, even dream about anything. So you need both. The trouble, however, is that no one yet in history and in, on the planet found the golden formula, the, you know, uh, the, the, the perfect mixture of uh, security and freedom. Each time you get more security, you surrender a bit of your freedom. There's no other way. Each time you get a bit more freedom, you surrender part of your security. So you gain something and you lose something.